Hello my friends, how are you all doing? Good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh. I'm going to be doing a full-on review on, I think, one of the best buys this year, one of the best releases in recent time. Very pumped up. I have done initial impression on this fragrance from this little sample that you see right there, courtesy of my brother Belal Bhai uh, from Bangladesh, our fragrance community member, uh, one of the senior members in the group. Uh, awesome, awesome collector. So he basically saves my life many times by offering me decants. He does this cute little decants of 2 ml, 5 ml, and uh, sometimes he refuses to take payment. But uh, I appreciate every single support from any member from my group or our community because it's, hey, it really helps my journey. So let's uh, tackle or do a full-on review on a full presentation. Jean-Paul Gaultier, Le Mal, Le Parfum. Uh, this is EDP Intense, okay, just like Ultra Male. I'm not going to bring out my other flankers of uh, Le Mal, but they are all there lined up. I have covered a lot of their flankers, including the original Le Mal, example Le Mal, uh, Christmas edition, Ultra Male, Popeye, so on and so forth. Okay, so this is the last one, and I'm pretty sure it's not gonna just stop here. Uh, they made Le Mal Essence de Parfum. I love that, and I think I think this is my uh, most favorite in the whole line okay and let's tackle it so first of all uh this is a giant 200 ml edition and i really wanted the big bottle i don't have anything of this like i want like a lamal bottle or ultra male of 200 ml but since i have them on 125 i'm gone with to 200 ml and you can get these uh bottles in usb uk sh uh, shopping from bd if you pre-ordered they bring for you they have 125 75 and 200 ml i don't know if this bigger size so the sample let it be there let me show you the tin can. I did not actually, I did. Uh, there's a one thing, okay? Like this outer thing, some of the writings and some of the pictures will disappear if you take out this plastic there, okay? As you can see, if you rip it out, some of the writings will go away. Like at the back, I'll show you. Uh, so I kept it. So it says very nice presentation, golden and kind of dark, Le Parfum. It's like a nice little packaging. They're all tin cans, this whole line. And at the back, they take sometimes beating and then get like this when they are transported via... Uh, sheep or I don't know carrier so here the name you must have seen this but I'm going to do my full-on review I I am big big thanks to USB if, if and by because uh, he promised me he's going to get it before the year ends I wanted to have this as my last bottle of the year so I have it so once you take out this sticker let's say you rip it out this picture will go away like many other Jean Paul Gaultier classic and others they put the picture here I really like it and uh, yeah this is open here you know you can if you want to Throw it away, it's up to you, but it's really nice. And let me show you the podium. It's like other Lamal podiums, but it, it has this podium. I took out the bottle already, as you can see. This is a new style. Back in the time, it has this like two plasticky thing, not very convenient. It's much better. Inside got this, uh, I don't know, a holder for the head of the bottle. But I'm not really a big fan of these because when you drop them, they can still break. So it's okay. The, it looks nice. Here is a beautiful bottle. I absolutely adore this. I love this male torso, like a navy man. It's very sexy. It, it looks like ultra male, but the color is a bit different. It has this golden. Uh, atomizer works fine. And this is, of course, this is the first uh, batch new fragrance. No issue with reformulation. So let me show you this typical sprayer a stopper here. These sometimes like come off and then, you know, uh, not really the best stopper, but it's okay. Let's show you the spray. Uh, yeah, here, I'll spray on my skin. I've been wearing this, I've been enjoying this since now. It's mild cold weather in Bangladesh. We're having like 16, 17 degrees or around their 20s. Nice little weather. So this is Lamal Le Parfum. Let's see, let's sniff it. I know this smell obviously from the sample, but big bottle experience. I think uh, those who ask me, is this a fragrance worth checking? This is a fragrance worth buying. Okay, I usually do not say that. I always say try and buy. If you are, if you like sweet perfumes, if you like good performer, if you like something to get compliments with, if you just simply want a fragrance without any worries in the world, like hey, hey, this what note is it natural ingredient ingredients? Hey, did they use like natural? Uh, you know. So <laughs> if you are that sort of a person, if you think a lot, okay. But this fragrance is a little bit expensive at this point, obviously. But price will go down in. Uh, time like say six months from now it will hit discounters okay so you can buy it then but it's a buy i'll start with that point because strong points and i'll have some criticism as well it smells darn good i did not look at the nose breakdown but it's just typical sweet 
many people will tell you this is modern interpretation of hybrid of ultramel and lamal but it smells more modern it smells like durum intense you know the way they built it it's my durum intense is at the back uh it smells a lot like uh it, they took the best out of all the lamal flankers essence de parfum ultra male lamal and perhaps aviator and in the navy so used like a lot of things but it's mostly sweet it's more sweet than fresh and i think there's usage of some spices maybe cardamom in there it's just lovely it smells like fruity it smells uh playful but not to the unisex point of ultra male which many people found to be a bit feminine i think this one uh yeah some people will still say it's sweet women can wear this i would say women can wear it but mostly when you spray this i just wore uh just let me tell you my experience i went six sprays with this uh, a few days back in a restaurant it's a big open space okay and i was walking around people are looking left and right despite wearing mask they can smell me of course six sprays is a lot but you will project for 2 to 3 hours this thing projects like a beast and it is i would say super with ultra male okay ultra male the way it projects longevity is also almost the same i would say ultra male is at 10 this is 9.5 that good uh the thing is it's not as dark as some of the fragrances like carlyle or signature so you'll find nothing to really uh worry that this is going to be like a challenging note to people they might dislike it make a face but this is such a gorgeous fragrance i think my dear brother shafi bhai says he bought it before me and he says uh, this fragrance is a perfect new year fragrance if you're going new york like uh, not new york new year <laughs> fragrance when you're going to be partying champagne booze clubbing dancing celebrating you know this year has been different but this is the kind of fragrance you want to end the year with this is why i wanted this to be my last bottle and for this year purchase but uh this year has been ups and downs a uh, lot of heartaches a lot of uh death news and everything and then i've been sick on and off uh, so everything you know like life is just uh, not the same but this fragrance put a big smile smile on my face i think if you really want to buy a fragrance this year they produce new modern sweet good performer like a whole package you know you pay money and you get your money's worth this is a fragrance this is the fragrance this is how you make a flanker like i hope they don't make anything after this to make it more ridiculous but this is where lamal should end their legacy and keep it uh, at least for a year let people enjoy their flankers uh, it's similar to lamal in many ways but lamal original just tell you one thing lamal will always have its place for me uh, these are my two bottles this is uh before puik took over this is a bpi version 2015 and this christmas edition i think 2016 or 17 what lamal does it has this kind of like a barber shopy uh old school mint lavender uh, you guys know vanilla combo and it has that mint is really nice i really enjoy lamal as its own, as its own perfume i'm not going to compare this like this is better than lamal or lamal has its place those who love lamal they're going to always cherish this perfume this is the bpi once again and the new puig they will say puig underneath they all looking same but i think these are yeah must probably puig it look the writing is a bit different so i enjoy lamal in winter as well but summer time it, it doesn't really work this one night time you wear it in summer it will amplify and with this formulation like the original formulation this is so strong so think of fragrances like you know pure excess night conceptually this is how they build this perfume crowd pleasing sweet compliment getters youthful even mature men can wear it but criticism would be it's not a formal fragrance do not wear this at work people look at you funny <laughs> uh, this is not very uh, serious formal fragrance with a suit it it may not make you look very serious people might think that you are uh, kidding you know like hey this guy cannot be taken seriously uh, you should wear something more like aventus or rylut that will be a formal perfume but this one right here one thing weakness uh or criticism every fragrance nothing is perfect nothing in this life is perfect car wise watch wise you'll always find something that's missing for from a product but that should not stop you you should know just you know like fragrances like human beings you know people will not be perfect okay and you have to accept it as they come uh try it out my humble suggestion is try it out if you are skeptical and you are on a budget you don't want to blind buy and then regret you regret a lot then don't blind buy but if you understand my channel you like 
sweet fragrance like I do, Mark does. I got that sweetness, uh, sweet tooth from Mark, basically. If you love sweet perfume, if you want to buy the best perfume this year, that's that's right there. Okay, Le Mol Le Parfum, EDP Intense, amazing. 200 ml, I am so happy I got this big boy. Okay, yes. Okay, so perfection, 10 out of 10. The best damn flanker in the market right now. Thanks for watching. Uh, enjoy it. Uh, summer nights wear not more than two sprays. That's my only request. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching. And uh, check out this perfume. See you soon. Good night from Dhaka Bangladesh. Bye-bye.